Welcome back crew and thank you for joining me on Astronia. Let's continue where we left off last time. Jump straight back into it. Now I last time I think we were going to explore that alien looking obelisk type thing. So I think I found out what it is. And I don't know if you remember, but there was three little plugs on it. Three little power things. I think we need to plug it in to power. I really don't think we have the capability of doing that just yet. But, for now, I think we need to start expanding the base just a little bit. And then maybe we can get uh, back on track. So, where is my cursor? There it is. I think we need to build another another platform just so we can get a small printer so we can get maybe a tractor up and running I think that will be the uh, I think that will be the the thing to do for this episode we will get another tractor we will get a tractor up and running all right so what do we want to research I think we want to research Probably not that. It does have storage on the side. So, what do we need for that? We need 500 bytes. Does that mean our research is done? Yes, it does. We need to chuck some more on there. Get some more bytes going. And hopefully by now, y'all have the... Uh, basics of the game down if you have been playing. If not, I will continue to try and describe th such things to you. But for now, let's go out and get some more resin because that is one of the basics that we need for construction of nearly everything. So just run out here quickly, grab little bit of this, little bit of that we got the organic, we cook up some nice little resin we cook up the organic it will be wonderful ok, thank you very much maybe perhaps we take a little tunnel do you like the tunnel? I like the tunnel oh, oh I think we dig a tunnel it is, it is wonderful, look we build a tunnel we go to the tunnel thank you alright I think we need to name this little character, by the way. We'll call him Frank. Frank, yes. Frank will do. Hello. Say hello, Frank. Hello. <laughs> oh, shit, I'm starving. Oh, I need oxygen. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry, Frank. From now, from time to time, I think we'll have Frank chime in on uh, various subjects and things. So, uh, for now, storage. I think excess storage will be on this platform here. What do you think, Frank? I think that's great. <laughs> Power cells we don't need right now. It could be used later. We have resin, though. Resin's good. What do we need? Platform. Big platform. I would like to get. Hmm. I'd like to get that one because it's got the storage on the side. I think we need the storage on the side. And it's only 100 bytes away. 102 bytes away to be precise. So for now, as much as it pains me to prolong this silly little waiting game we like to play. I think we might go off and explore a little bit. Do we have tethers? No. We do have more tethers. Let's go out here. Dee -doo -doo. This compound here we will need for more tethers. Wonderful. I think we should probably. Oh, no, we got gained a, a platform from here last time. 
So let's explore a little bit further, see if we can't find a little bit more, hopefully a spare platform that we can chuck a small printer on, because that's where you get, oh shit, sorry, language, we don't use bad language here on Captain Kokomo's crew. Let's go to the top of this hill to see what we could see, lots and lots of granite and rock and crap that we don't really need. But this clay we will use. Clay, I think I told you, can be refined into ceramic, which is very useful later on. So we will grab as much of it as we can right now. I think we've got heaps. Leave some of it exposed, just oh, if we can. Yeah, that'll do. We'll leave some of it exposed, just so we know what's there for next time. Is there anything else out here that we need to grab? I'm gonna try and keep these episodes in shorter formats, like 20 minutes. Uh, there is nothing over this hill. We are exploring the depths of the mountains, the rocky tundra. Oh, what is it? No, there is nothing up there. Oh, run out of tethers. What do you know? Rob's your mother's brother. We've run out of tethers. Get some more tethers. And up the mountain we go. Yep, we are now the mountain climbers up into the snow. Oh, that was a little too far from the last one. It can happen, and it does happen. Nothing really of interest out here anyway, except for that. I think we might save that for when we have a vehicle to get it back with. What is this? Is this research? No, this is not. No, it's just a rock. Down the mountain we go. Let's go back to base. Drop off all this ceramic. No, jump. We don't want to slide because you slow down when you slide. Slip slide in away. Oh, that's a research. Let's take that back. You can carry that. Gee, thanks. Oh, I always have to carry the heavy stuff because we go slower if you don't. Oh, I don't like it. Can we get a, a vehicle of some sort so I don't have to carry this crap everywhere? Yes, we are working on it, Frank. Just drop this here. Hang on, what do I need? Can I build a small printer in... I can build a small printer here. All I need is some compound, and I can just swap it out. I, I can just take that one off, and chuck a small one on. For now, let's just throw all this in here, and I think, I promise you by the end of this episode, we will have a tractor. It's a big call, I know, but let's go and get some compound, I see some over here. Oh, excuse me, that was a little bit rude of me. Workload, small generator, small printer. Let's build a small printer. Not really sure what a small printer makes, but we are about to find out. Although I'm reasonably sure that it does make...
we need to turn that bad boy around. There we go. Rover seat, medium printer, platform A, rover seat. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Yeah, excuse you. <laughs> Thank you, Frank. How much do we need for that tractor? Two aluminium. That means we're going to go exploring. Is we're going to need... Oh, jeez. Maybe I have, to, I have to renege on my promise. But I do believe we need this. So now I will put that print, large printer back on because this is going to get very messy very quickly. Uh, we need... What do we need? That one. That one. And... Heavens. Platform B, we need three resin. Alright. Don't have three resin. I'm gonna have to go and find more resin! <laughs> Did we get an extra? Oh, we got four resin now. Let's go back and build that large platform and throw on a thing with a thing in it. Oh jeez, let's get out of the way first. Large platform. Why can't I build it? Is it obstructed? Is that what it is? Yeah, it's obstructed. Alright. Gonna have to do a little bit of remodeling. It's fine, it's fine, really, it's fine. No. Yep. No. No, thank you. Move this bad boy out a little bit more. Put that one on there. Put that one into. This is getting complicated. There we go. And we plug that into there. Large platform B. Wonderful. Now, Frank, what are we going to put on this? Well, I was thinking maybe we can swap the medium printer onto it and then we can chuck the small printer on this little one over here because it's got a little bit of storage either side of it so uh, that'll work <laughs> Frank I like the way you think buddy that's gonna take a little while you know what else will help I think we could probably make a little generator Actually, no, those. We need one of those. Canister, so we can start moulding the earth. Because you need a canister to start shaping the earth around you. Like, if you want to build something up, take it down, that sort of thing, you need to have a canister. Because it fills up with earth. I don't know if you can see that on the, my little backpack there. It, uh, the canister is filling up, so that'll allow us to do this. Smooth it out. It'll allow us to build up. So yeah, that is going to be very, very handy. Because I would like to build a bigger platform area for the base. Appreciate all those comments, by the way, friends and family at the moment, but the more people that comment, share and like, it really does help me out. It, if you could just get other people to maybe take a look, that'd be a huge help. Hang on, our little platform is done. Alright, we don't, oh, we're going to need room there. 
Alright. You know what? I'm going to leave it for now because I'm going to use this little doobalaki to smooth it all out. Smooth out the area, create a big flat spot. This is going to be the dance floor, and you're all invited. Oh dear. Can get a little tricky. I hope this is going to work out. It looks like it's going well. This should be good. I think we'll have enough room now. Yep, I think we're going to have enough room. So let's grab this up here, spin it around. Hopefully that's the right way, and unpack. It's not the right way. We have a 50-50 chance of getting it right, and we got it wrong. Why didn't you all tell me? Alright, now I will put this... Oh, I need a smelter. <gasps> Heavens, this is getting very complicated. What uh, do we need for a smelter? We have not unlocked it yet. Hmm. Bother. This is getting all rather confusing. Let's get this on the road. Haven't done really much in this episode, have we? I wonder if I could check a small spell through on there. No, I'll leave that there. A large printer. Do I need a large printer? Not yet. I don't need one yet. I'm gonna need more resin for that. Research chamber, don't need. We are still very early game, folks. We're gonna need to explore a hell of a lot more. For now, I think we'll go out and grab a little bit more resin because we're going through it really quickly. So what do you think we should do next, uh, Frank? Well, I'm getting really sick of running around everywhere, mate. If we could organize a bit of transport for me, <laughs> that'd, make, that'd make things a lot easier. <laughs> you got it, buddy. Now, I've muted Frank, so he cannot hear me, but um, I don't know if we're going to keep Frank around. We might totally delete his personality, and we might just set it off Set off on our own. Who knows? Don't have enough. Alright. What else can I do? I need... I need the smelter. I can unlock the smelter. Yes! We had one bite left. Now, this will... Smelting furnace, we need two resin, one compound. We need more compound. Let's go and grab some more compound from over here. Because I see some. We've exhausted that little patch for now. So, we need one of these and two resin to make a smelter. I'll grab another one because I want to get that small generator up and running. Well, this might be a pretty thick deposit. Alright, we've got a couple extras. That should do us for now. The smelting furnace, we have enough. We just need to get out of his way. There we go. Smelting furnace. Now we can make the aluminium to get 
the tractor up and running. So, to get aluminium, we're going to need more tethers and we're going to need to go underground. Small generator. Yeah, I'll check one on. Looks like we could use it. Where did it go? Tether bundle, yep. There it is. We will put it on there. And we will use the... I believe it runs on organic. Yep. And we'll put the organic next to it. So any organic that we accidentally collect from mining or whatever, we will chuck on there. And you know what? That battery, we'll just chuck there as well. Boost the power even more. Hang on, this is nearly done. Here we go. Yeehaw! Excellent. While we're here, no, no, we need to conserve power. Speaking of power, I need you, 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 to be there. And I need a printer to, a small printer to be there, maybe? Can I do that? Can I? Yep. Will that work? Is it going to be a No, I can still do everything. We have a multi-printer platform. Oh, and there's another one here. We might just chuck that next to the storage. Is that going to be close enough? I doubt it. But anyway, we have tethers. So let's go off in search of a cave. We're going to go some cave diving. Check out this wreckage over here, see if there's anything useful first. Realise I'm probably running close on time. Go over the resin patch. What is this? A small battery. We will keep. And the rest of it is just junk. Oh, there's something over there we can just explore. This is what you do. You just strike out in a random direction and you never know what you'll come across. Oh, this could be a... Oh no, that's a great bloody chasm that has nothing in it. So, let's keep on searching, shall we? For those of you who know how to play the game, I'd like to hear your thoughts on what we should do next. If you think we should uh, get the um, ancient artifact up and running, get a a uh, vehicle up and running, because I'm going to try and get it done this time, but I honestly don't think I'm going to have the time. But we did get the smelting forge. And we've hooked up with another... thing over here. Yep, we've linked it. Wonderful. Aww. Yeah, I know, mate. That goes off to the giant bloody thing over there. What have we got in here? Anything exciting on this? Negative. Alright. Well, we did accomplish something for this episode. I don't know how long this has gone for so far. Doesn't exactly tell me. Readily. So we'll go for another five minutes. Let's say another five minutes and then... Uh, we'll search for a canyon that we can explore next time. Not that big hole. We need a proper cave. We will sort search for a cave this time. And uh, next episode, we will go spelunking. We will go and search the big cave, big nasty cave for some 
there you go, up on there, up on there, up, there you go, up on there for, um, we'll search it for some aluminium, or aluminium for our American friends. I believe the ore is called laterite. What have we here? No, they might just be holes that I dug. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. Let's run out here, searching for a big cave to... Really? Normally when you do a new map, you come across... I don't know. I know. You come across so many big caves in the... I'm gonna have to dig down by myself. Let's see what's over here first. So yeah, comments down below. Thinking about doing a uh, foundation playthrough as well. So those of you who have heard heard of the game, those of you who haven't, let me know what you think. It's a nice little city builder game. It's still in early access, but I think it's got a lot of potential. It's kind of like a at the moment it's a very basic version of Banished. Hmm. Alright. More compound. I think we need more compound so we can get more tethers. There's resin in this hole. That's not going to help. You know what? I'm just going to run it. There we go. Oh, there's another wind vane over here. Lovely little wind vane. So tips and tricks, everything to help. I'm also looking for somebody to do artwork. I'm. This is all very basic. My channel at the moment is pretty basic when it comes to artwork and whatnot. So if you know anyone or you are keen on doing some artwork, I will give you the credit in the in every video that I do. That, I use the artwork in and I'll also recommend you to anyone who is looking for artwork to be done so if you can help at all with that I'd appreciate it oh dear so yeah this has been a very uneventful episode I think what hell what are Research, more research. Oh, it gets a little finicky some time. There we go. Another 360. Let's see what we can do. Can we get anything yet? I'd like to unlock the tractor. No, I can't get the tractor yet. Gonna be quite a little while. Tractor trailer is also going to be quite a little while. Maybe you should get another. Maybe I should get another research chamber up and running. I know a lot of people do that. We'll see. We'll see. While I'm back here, I might as well chuck this little wind vane back on. Every little power boost will help. We're going out this way this time. There's nothing on here. Oh, hang on. Do we have a cave? No, it's just a little hole. That was a little far away. We have some more clay over here. Like I said, I'm really surprised that I haven't found any caves. 
This is a kind of make it difficult to get aluminium or aluminium. I would love to show you guys a big cave to that we can explore, but it's just not working. Damn it. I have to practice that so I can get it spaced out just right. Up the top of the hill, what do we got up here? There we go. That looks like a cave down there. Yep, there we go. We've got a cave. This is gonna. We're gonna come back here. We're gonna have to come back here. So. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna have to leave it there for now. I think that's been long enough. Next time we will go spelunking and hopefully get some aluminium and get research points so we can get that tractor up and running. So until then, tips and comments down the bottom. Let me know if you like it. Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe. Tell your friends. Tell your dog. Tell your mum. And I will see you all in the next one.